Okay, so imagine this. You walk into your kitchen, and your robot assistant is already making breakfast. Not just grabbing a cup or two, I mean chopping, cooking, even plating. And then, while you're getting ready, it helps your grandma out of her chair, guides her to the hallway, and reminds her to take her meds. Now here's the twist. This isn't a $100,000 science project or something out of a sci-fi film. It's real. It's from Tesla. And it might only cost $2,579. Yeah, that's not a typo. Today we're opening up the hood on Tesla's Optimus Gen 3, how it works, what's inside, and why it's absolutely wrecking the competition. This thing isn't just a robot, it's an independence machine. Especially for people with disabilities. Let's get into it. Back in 2022, Tesla showed off the first Optimus robot. And let's be real, it was barely more than a glorified mannequin that could wobble around. It moved slow, under 2K meta, and had clunky grip strength and pretty basic object recognition. Fast forward just a couple years, and Gen 2 upped the game. Think better articulation, more agile hands, faster walking speeds about 8 km h and a price around $20,000 to $30,000. Already a fraction of what high-end bots cost. But now, Gen 3? It's on another level entirely. We're talking 10 to 12 kilometers, walking speed, 40% longer battery life, and the kind of grip precision you'd expect from a seasoned chef, not a robot. It's got an upgraded brain to better AI, sharper vision, 99.7% facial recognition accuracy, and voice command detection even in loud environments. And it talks to your Tesla car, your solar roof, even your power wall. It's not just smart, it's integrated. Now, let's talk about impact. Because what makes Gen 3 different isn't just the specs, it's what those specs do. For people with mobility challenges, this isn't some gimmick, this is freedom. Optimus can push a wheelchair, and it does it smartly. It adjusts to terrain, slopes, obstacles, keeping a steady pace no matter where you are. No jerky starts or sudden stops. Need help standing? It can safely lift up to 180 LBs, giving support for sit-to-stand transitions. That's huge for people with Parkinson's arthritis or muscular dystrophy. And for the blind or visually impaired, Optimus goes way beyond canes or guide dogs. It uses LiDAR and computer vision to navigate with 97.3% obstacle detection accuracy. Even things like hanging branches are temporary barriers that most guide dogs can't anticipate. That means 3.4 extra hours a day of solo, independent activity, no human help needed. Grocery store, done. Doctor's appointment, no problem. It even talks you through it. Crosswalk ahead, car approaching, obstacle to your left. It's basically a second pair of eyes and a brain. If you've got limited hand movement, maybe from a spinal injury, MS, or cerebral palsy. This part's for you. Optimus Gen 3 has hands that detect pressure as low as 0.3 newtons. For context, most industrial robots are four times less sensitive. That means it can actually cook, pour liquids, handle delicate objects, and prep meals without wrecking everything. It follows over 250 recipes, too. And we're not talking microwaving something this is real food, made fresh. Dressing? It'll help button shirts, zip jackets, and even deal with accessories. Dressing time that used to take half an hour with help? Cut in half, or even gone altogether. It also sorts pills correctly, without crushing them, which is massive for people with tremors or paralysis. If you're dealing with serious mobility issues, like quadriplegia or ALS, Gen 3 isn't just a tool. It's a lifeline. Voice command support is deep. 1,200 plus voice commands. Background noise filtering up to 94%. Even in a room as loud as a city street. You can say, bring me my Medicat ion. Boom, done. Call 911. It'll do it and then send your medical info to first responders. Unlock the front door and cut response times by over seven minutes in some simulations. Let that sink in. 
This robot can save your life faster than a standard emergency alert device. And it learns. Over time, it tracks 87 daily habits, knows when you usually wake up, can prep your morning routine, detects if you're getting fatigued, even picks up on abnormal breathing patterns and triggers emergency protocols. This isn't a robot. This is a personal assistant that grows with you. What about downtime, battery life, charging? Tesla already thought of that. Optimus docks itself to a charging station when needed. One charge equal to 10 to 12 hours of use. But here's the kicker. If there's a blackout, it auto switches to Tesla Powerwall backup and keeps running for up to 72 hours. That's three full days of uninterrupted help. No need to panic during outages. That's critical for overnight support, which is when most caregiver injuries happen, by the way. So where's everyone else in this race? Toyota's human support robot can open doors and pick up objects, sure, but it can't cook, dress, or help with mobility. Price tag? Over $100,000. SoftBank's Pepper is great at small talk, but that's about it. Can't feed you, can't dress you, can't even climb a slope. Even Samsung's bot handy, still in R&D, is expected to come in over $30,000. And it's nowhere near Tesla's level of full-body dexterity. Tesla's Optimus Gen 3? It's expected to come in at just $15,000 to $18,000. And if government subsidies kick in, that could drop to $5,000 to $7,000. Around the same as a high-end wheelchair, but with a whole lot more power under the hood. How the hell is Tesla doing this so cheap? Simple. They're recycling their own tech, the same AI chips from Tesla cars, the same motors, the same battery cells from their 4,680 factories. This isn't a robot company starting from scratch. It's Tesla doing what it always does, scaling up fast, cutting costs and flipping the industry upside down. And the cost saving isn't just for Tesla, it's for the user too. Hiring a caregiver in the US costs around $58,000 a year. Buy a Gen 3 robot for $18,000 and it pays for itself in four to six months. After that, no more recurring costs. That's not a luxury. That's survival level affordability. So let's step back for a second. This thing walks, talks, cooks, lifts, thinks, saves lives. And it might only cost you the same as a used laptop and a PlayStation. For the 4.7 million Americans who need daily assistance and the 61% of disabled folks living on under $35,000 a year, this isn't just another gadget. It's freedom, independence, dignity. Optimus Gen 3 isn't perfect, but it's the closest thing we've seen to assistive robotics finally getting it right. And it's coming fast. What's the first task you'd want your Optimus to help you with? Let me know in the comments. And that's all for today. If you found this video interesting, make sure you hit the like button. And also don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more of these kinds of videos. Thanks for watching.